Our top story at 6, a post on Facebook lands a Portsmouth teenager in deep trouble. He's a 10th grader at Wilson High and he's in custody tonight after posting pictures of guns and comments about shooting up his school. Then in your sides, Ava Hurdle was there when school let out. She has reaction to this threat taken pretty seriously, Ava. Well, that's right, Tom. Students we talked with said they either learned of the threat from social media or heard about it in school today. Police kept watch as students left for the day. This after it was discovered Tuesday that a 16-year-old sophomore posted, quote, comments alluding to shooting up the school with pictures of guns on Facebook. I didn't really think it was real. I just, um, I, people were talking, um, uh, talking smack. Saw you heard about it in school today and so did Cody Rawlings. I was in lunch and one of my friends next to me, they told me that, well, they saw on Facebook that there was going to be this whole thing and that this guy had took pictures of guns, said he what he was going to do. I just kind of just blew it off because it's been going on a lot now, but still at the same time, it can be a serious matter. And that's what another student, Ryan St. Prevel, concluded. At first, I thought it was a hoax because everybody talking about how they're going to do something for the last day for the seniors and stuff. So I thought it was a joke and everything, but I seen a lot of people commenting on Facebook about it. And I was like, hmm, this might be a little serious because something like this happened some years earlier. Police say there was no evidence of any guns taken to or near the school, and there was never any lockdown. Now that teen is held in detention tonight for threatening bodily harm. He faces school disciplinary action as well. We're live in Portsmouth, Ava Hurdle. 10 on your side. And to add, the teen will be held in the Chesapeake Detention Center until his hearing. We have more on this arrest and on a previous story on a series of threats and its effects on students in another district right now on wavy.com.